This video is proudly recorded and produced on OpenBSD. Let's talk about how to switch to Google and or Cloudflare DNS server under OpenBSD. In the old days, what you could do uh, it was to actually to modify the resolveconf file and point to whatever DNS server that you wish. But that's not the case anymore because this resolve conf file is handled by the resolve daemon or resolve d and the reason for it is because there are many programs uh, daemons services try to update this one and it creates it chaos so this resolve daemon uh, listens to these services to uh, daemons and then update the resolve conf accordingly and based on the priority that it determines for example it listens to unwind uh, DH, uh, dhc client uh, please whatever not necessarily listen but it basically based on learns from them and then updates this resolve conf and the highest priority is with unwind so updating the resolve conf is not the solution unless you go and disable the resolve D and that's something that we don't want to do because if we do it we have to actually manually maintain this resolve conf and that may create chaos the best way is to have a solution that kind of signals the resolve D and then resolve D updates the resolve conf so for that one the best option i have found so far is unwind and what this unwind does it validates dns resolver and is suitable for the workstations and or laptops and only it listens to the local host so with the unwind which utilizes the unwind conf file we can create something like a custom dns uh, uh, file and then say okay now instrument the resolve d to update the resolve conf to use the dns that i provided and for example i can create a macro or whatever and then basically here say forwarder gives the list of the addresses and these are the dns name servers but before starting with this unwind thingy, I want to show you something. I want to show you my current uh, uh, DNS uh, situation and afterwards compare it once we have applied the unwind. So as you can see, it's resolved by my ISP and that's not something that I want. So I'm going to apply the Google DNS necessary. I don't recommend google dns this is something i use for this tutorial i may use different uh, dns but google is the one that is widely used so that's why i'm using it for this tutorial so for the unwind we have to create a unwind conf file under etsy directory and then add some details to it so we can say forwarder and then directly pass the ip address of the dns server and the next line we have to say preference is with the forwarder if you don't specify this preference forwarder unwind makes a decision to whether forward it to the default which is your isp or to use this uh, Google DNS but we want to enforce to use Google DNS all the time so that's why we have the preference for water and the next step is to either restart the unwind uh, daemon or start it if it's not started the best way is to check it rc ctl check unwind and as you can see it's not running so first I'm going to enable it and then I'm going to start it. So enabling it is useful in case that you want to use 
unwind after you shut down or you restarted machine so the, then unwind starts automatically and a start is useful if you want to start it right away now this one is applied we can double check it simply by uh, cutting the uh, resolve count file and as you can see it's updated the, pre the, the old content is commented and now it's handled by the unwind to verify that I will do another DNS leak check to ensure that the uh, DNS is updated great now it resolves to the Google DNS and we are technically done but what if I want to have more than one DNS server can unwind do that of course it can so what we can do we can actually go edit the unwind file again and the best is to use uh, the macro feature to not create the mess here at a list of uh, IPs we can actually create the macro it's much cleaner so I define something like macro or you can call it even variable doesn't matter so I can say Google and then I can say Cloudflare for example or whatever DNS that you prefer to use and here I can actually pass the list based on the whatever priority I wish so Cloudflare for example first and Google second and I can I have to now restart the unwind daemon so changes has taken effect now let's do another dns leak and see what's the situation fantastic now as you can see it uses both cloudflare and google that's all for this video i hope you have learned something I would like to take a moment to thank Patreon contributors Grok with 30 generous dollar, Stellar Orbit with 20 generous dollar, OpenBSD Maximalist, Alexander M, OpenBSD Enthusiast, DM'd, John Collins, and Liquid Mobius.